They were out slaying dragons today in temperance with bows and arrows. You heard that right, dragons. Dick Berry explains it was all to help a sick young boy. Sunday was World Dragon Slaying Day in Temperance, Michigan. The motto, impacting the world one arrow at a time. You may not know who Dennis Kouth is, but you probably played or heard of the Dungeons and Dragons game. Dennis was one of the original artists and father of Wyatt McElroy. He was really tall and he was really chubby. Dennis loved archery. He died in 2013. That's why 150 archers brought their bows and arrows to the Tomahawk Archers Sunday to slay dragons over a 30 target course. I find it very peaceful. I mean, just you kind of zone in and focus and just let the arrows fly. Money raised will benefit Dylan Sweets, a 13 year old local boy battling a rare form of cancer. I like archery a lot and I really like the mission of today. I really like the idea that we're going to be helping somebody. The dragon shoot is happening because of Wyatt and the love he has for his dad. He believes everyone has a dragon to slay in life, be it drugs, alcohol, depression, or something else. For Wyatt, it was overcoming the grief of his dad's death at such a young age. It just calms me down and it keeps me focused on the bow, the arrow, and the target. Today, World Dragon Day is in 38 states and 65 countries. At every location, a person or organization benefits. Talk about hitting a bullseye. We feel it's important, one is, it's community helping community, all right? And I feel, and it's my personal opinion, that we need more of that right now. And archery is a, a huge way of doing that. Whether you're an archer or not, Wyatt McElroy wants all of us to keep in mind what he believes. Dream big, shoot straight, aim small. In Temperance, I'm Dick Berry, WTOL 11.